our final skater is going to bring the house down i wish her well but she hasn't really got the program to compete with the three russian girls it's an incredible atmosphere in here she goes into this lying in sixth place after the short program remember Kira Korpi, who was in fourth, has withdrawn, so effectively that's fifth place. We wish her well. It's uh, Joshi Helgeson for Sweden. On the wall, who is fairest of them all? Snow White and the Huntsman, the music. Oh, yes. Bring it on. Triple looks, double toe. Well, she looks on the money, too. That was a toe loop. for the triple loop. Just had to step out of it. Interesting and intriguing theme. Really capturing the attention of the audience. Oh, she really pushed her way through that. Second Lutz. She's uh, making these jumps count. We're into the second half. Only two more jump elements to go. And uh, makes a mistake there. Single Salco, but she's got the double axle out afterwards. Well, it's not easy to skate at the end of the group. You've got about a half an hour to wait, and uh, with all the expectation from your home fans, it uh, makes it even harder. But she coped well, her sister leading the applause. It uh, really has been a fantastic achievement by the two Swedish sisters. 
That should keep her up in the mix. She's not going to win a medal, but she, she, she's won the admiration of so many people here in this Ericsson Globe arena. And I, I, I wonder who you'd have above who uh, with Victoria and Joshi. Well, Joshi's going to benefit because she had the Lutzes, whereas her sister yes. didn't. So that's going to help her technically. Um, technically. So she may just get art it. Artistically, I'm... Yeah, Almost it's a the, difficult one. The other way towards Victoria, yeah. a little bit more. I'm with you. So the Lutz and the overall, because uh, Victoria had some problems with the the hands down, didn't she, on the south cam, yeah. just stepping out a bit. So that could be what makes the difference: the fact that she had the Lutzes in the program. I love the outfit here, the idea of the theme, and the way it was sold to. I think uh, I'm just blown away that one family can be in the final group of the Europeans, the two girls doing this. It's just extraordinary. Yeah, and they, in all likelihood, they're going to finish in the top five, aren't they? Both girls. So there won't be a family party tonight because it'd be the banquet, but I think tomorrow lunchtime. Oh, it's the gala, though. They'll be putting in for the gala. <laughs> Okay, so, yep, still some work to do. Yeah, what an amazing achievement. Coached by mum as well. And I suppose we ought to give a shout out to uh, Angelina Kuchvalska, the uh, Latvian who skated early on. She's at the moment in fourth place on the free, not overall because of her placing in the short program, which wasn't good. But, uh, boy, did she deliver on the free. It was a superb performance. It was almost a surprise because she was yes, delivering it, was. it so well. Yeah. And, and early and not as expected. Yeah, it was great that the judges went with it. Well, the girls have definitely delivered here in this European Championships. A bit, bit, little bit disappointed with the men. But uh, no disappointment here. Consistency and nerves of steel shown by many of the top skaters here. And if you'd actually taken Anna Pogorelia's routine and taken it back maybe a few years and put that down in the final of the European ladies, I think she would have done a lot better than here. It'll be third. Wow, we what a team. So here we go. Where will it be? You can hear a pin drop in the arena. 109.52. That's a fabulous score for her. It's fourth place for Joshi. Fourth and fifth for the Helgerson sisters. Absolutely amazing achievement. Unbelievable. You'd think she'd won a medal, but she hasn't because of the uh, domination by the three Russian girls. But uh, what an incredible achievement by Joshi Helgerson and her sister Victoria and mum there as well. Fabulous result. Well deserved. Just so brilliant. I think we'll have a glass of champagne for you ourselves tonight. We will indeed. So uh, at the end of the day, it's Elizaveta Tuktimisheva who wins with 210.40, a win in the free, second in the short, then Elena Radianova, Anna Pogorelia takes the bronze medal, and the two Swedish sisters there in fourth and fifth place.